It's time to hold your breath and cross your fingers because I have just been handed the judges' list of four runners-up and the new Miss Universe. The waiting is over. Miss Hong Kong of 1973, Elaine Sung, is ready with the trophies over here. And Miss Hong Kong of 1974, Jojo Chung, has the flowers over here for one of you. The most fabulous year of your life is about to begin. Good luck to each one of you. Now, I will begin with the fourth runner-up, ladies and gentlemen. The fourth runner-up for the title of Miss Universe is Miss Australia. The third runner-up is Miss Scotland. The second runner-up is Miss Wales. Now, will both of you just step right down here, please? One of you is about to become Miss Universe. The other will be the first runner-up, a title that is a very important title, because if for any reason Miss Universe cannot fulfill her obligation for the entire year, then the first runner-up becomes Miss Universe. I will announce the first runner-up first. The first runner-up is Miss Venezuela. Miss Israel is Miss Universe. Messinger of Israel is our new Miss Universe. Will you please make your first walk as Miss Universe, greet these wonderful people of Hong Kong, and will you please, Anne-Marie Cotomo, read the Miss Universe brief. We, yet the young women of the universe, believe people everywhere are seeking peace, tolerance, and mutual understanding. We pledge to spread this message in every way we can, wherever we go. Miss Israel is from Chivillon. She's 20 years old. She's a student at Tel Aviv University, studying aerodynamics. Her life ambition is to design aircraft. Her hobbies are ballet dancing, flying gl uh, gliders, and playing tennis. 